everyone. Welcome to CMO Chats. My name is Alan Dobrea, and I'm the head of marketing services at Zalora in Southeast Asia. Can you tell us a bit about your journey and what sparked your interest in marketing? Yeah, so I studied marketing at university, and then I went into the agency world, uh, spent some time in a few agencies in London, then moved client side to Marks and Spencer, where I had the opportunity to work on different categories across UK and international markets. And then uh, I decided that I wanted to move uh, into Asia, having done study exchanges in China and India. So that's where I ended up uh, at Zalora, where I've now been for six years and uh, very excited for uh, the, the path ahead. What does your company do? So Zalora is uh, Asia's online fashion and lifestyle destination. The company was founded in 2012, and we have a presence in Singapore, Indonesia, Malaysia, Philippines, Hong Kong, and Taiwan. And we are Asia's fashion expert. So we offer an extensive collection of top international and local brands and products across a variety of categories, including apparel, sports, shoes, accessory, luxury, and beauty for men and women. What is currently your main marketing focus? My focus is on 360 marketing uh, through the power of retail media and partnerships with the thousands of brands on Zalora. So my team and I run the Zalora advertising platform, which is a cutting edge marketing unit that offers innovative solutions to brands and advertisers in the markets uh, that I mentioned. And we leverage on Zalora's extensive reach uh, to help brands connect with customers in meaningful ways. So we enable them to run campaigns uh, 360 uh, and drive awareness, drive sales, celebrate product launches, and we can craft tailored campaigns that resonate with customers on Zalora's own uh, ecosystem and beyond that as well. Can you tell me a bit about a particularly innovative or successful marketing campaign that your team has executed? Yeah, I think a really successful one was uh, our pop-up um, called The Terminal, which we ran in Q4 last year during the end of year travel season. So The Terminal was a week long offline pop-up experience where we showcased the latest and greatest from Zalora's top global brands in fashion, beauty, luxury, lifestyle. And we had uh, a curation of over 40 brands across these categories. And the idea behind it was to create um, an immersive and seamless uh, omnichannel shopping experience. So customers were able to interact uh, with the products and we, the idea was to create wow moments uh, for them and elevate the, uh, the customer journey. What are your biggest marketing challenges at the moment? I think there are quite a few. Um, I think the key ones from my perspective are being um, re related to the developments uh, in terms of um, the platforms that are being used for marketing. So I think there's uh, a lot of shift in terms of where customers are you know, hanging out and platforms that customers are utilizing. Then there's a lot of customer insight changes in terms of how customers consume media and how customers interact with brands. And I think that leads to the question as to how can brands stay relevant in culture and, you know, what sort of campaigns, what sort of experiences do brands need to offer customers to, to remain and stay relevant? Another big challenge, I think, is to do with uh, the, the part of the business that I mentioned in terms of retail media, where we are constantly innovating and updating uh, our platform to allow our partners to deliver better performance and better campaigns. And uh, a big part of this is or has to do with the utilizing also the power of artificial intelligence and 
making things uh, easier for, for our brand partners to, to engage with customers. How does your company stay ahead of its competitors? At Zalora, I think we are about making the shopping as convenient as possible and offering the best assortment um, and inspiration as well as discoverability of, uh, of products. So I think that's kind of what sets Zalora apart from our competitors in the, in the fashion uh, ecosystem. And then I think all regarding the convenience, um, we utilize digital payments. We have a no questions asked 30 day return policy. We have click and collect uh, for customers across different convenience stores across the region. We also have uh, our loyalty program called Zalora VIP, where customers can have uh, express delivery service and partner experiences. So ultimately, I think it is about the customer experiences and uh, the services that we provide to, to our customers. In your opinion, what does the future of marketing look like? I think the future of marketing is very exciting. There's going to be a plethora of tools and uh, ways of doing things more efficiently, I believe, by utilizing or leveraging more on the power of technology and the power of AI. So what that would lead to is enabling marketers to have more focus on the creative and strategy side of things and being less burdened by the admin or operational day-to-day -day tasks, which I think can be you know, enabled or leveraged through the power of AI. So I think the future is very exciting because we'll be able to use technology to free up some time and focus on the bigger tasks at hand. What is the role of a head of marketing in one word and why? The one word is conductor, as a orchestra conductor in a way, because we as the heads of marketing have to direct the performance of the orchestra, or in this case, the marketing uh, organization and drive the revenues for, for the businesses. So we are the, you know, the person that's reliable for driving the performance of various, you know, individuals and stakeholders and channels across, across the different organizations. So we might, we need to make sure we orchestrate everything perfectly. And what career advice would you like to share with other marketing leaders? I think the career advice that has served me really well up until now has been to never stop learning. So basically aim to learn something new every day and try to be 1% better every day. So that would involve reading, testing new things, interacting with, uh, you know, with industry peers. Um, so basically having this growth mindset uh, and living that through day in and day out.